absolutely. The amazing thing to me is that he was elected captain as a backup. And the first pass out to Keithy, one of the tight ends. Huge weapons for you. Came his. It is a pretty notable story. High snap, and that is part of the story. Practice together, and all of a sudden you have a problem. So there's Miley. He is the center at the start of the game. Play action. Rising is going to throw it. And that pass hit the line of scrimmage. You got Tavion Thomas in the backfield. He's going to get the ball, and he will get the first down and more. Crossing it over. So now that he's solved that, he's gotten the bulk of the work, although they have talented backs behind him. Thomas gets another carry. To be really aggressive. Statistically, UCLA's rush defense has been extremely stout. A little end around to Covey, and Covey got a hand on the ankle to set up third and short. Yeah, Quinn Lake, the safety, comes from the other side and chased him down. Quick snap on third and short. First down, Utah. Personal foul. Utah is to Face what pass. they're trying to do. Defense how number 15. 15 will be added to the end of the play. Automatic first down. That zone. Whereas over the years with Kyle Whittingham, the run game in the red zone has been their strength. Covey, another one of those pitch plays, and this Whittingham doesn't even really go by that number. He goes by TD percentage, and that's not very good either. Thomas gets the carry left side. Thomas in this direction there opened up that edge. No edge replacement by UCLA. Look at that. No edge coverage. Will win the Pac-12 South. I think we'll see. A lot of football still to be played. But it has been chaotic. Now, penalty flag on the first play. And then we offside. had a cool little end Defense zone dance from Tavian Thomas. UCLA was off sides on that play. Yeah, we're, we're seeing an uptick in false starts off sides this season. I mean, that that has got to be just so frustrating, though. The handoff for you. This one, not as damaging. Just a five-yard penalty. Cam rising in the pocket across the middle. Yeah, I saw a lot of costume people today. No, it's a Saturday. Halloween falls on a Sunday. More fun, I think. Back. Good news for Utah. Satoa Lameo limped off, is back on the field. Thomas, man, you can see why Utah likes him. Number 24 for the Bruins. First down into UCLA territory. A little pressure came and a pass caught. Oh. What happened? He was thinking pick six. Watch 37 come into your front. They'll give him the ball in the run game. Kincaid's kind of the hybrid guy. He can do a little bit of both. Rising on the move is going to throw it short on a 10. And Rising kept it. There's a design run around. Yeah. Final minute here of the first quarter. Rising under. Get lost for the linebackers. The three tight end formation to run the ball straight. Very, very premature death in the last calendar year. And Utah just retired the number 22 first number retired in the history. Hard not to think that this team is getting an extra boost from somewhere. I don't think there's any doubt about it. The players have near the top of the list for the Heisman Trophy. As far as I'm concerned, that was a great performance. Cam Rising drops it in. Talk about a throw, man. That corner out by Keithy. Perfectly done. But watch him drop this one. It's hard to beat. What a game that was. Utah near midfield. A little flea flicker. Rising, throwing deep across the middle to Vele. Too long. Vele was out there by himself for a long time. This ball's got to be thrown sooner, right now, right now. But he he hitched too long by Lake. Number one to hustle to get there. Number two not to knock Vele over and yeah. commit a penalty. To never give up on it. That was well done. Pledger gets the carry. Huge hole. Pledger into the open. Inside the 20. Game on yeah. the ground. It's the second or third time we've seen the tight end shift cause them a problem. Pledger straight ahead. Yeah. He's got to be involved with the run defense, not so much the pass defense. Rising, faked it. Keeps it. Rising inside the 10. Tight ends. Keithy, Kincaid, Fathering. Gee, they got a million them. tight ends out there now. And off Pledger. And he gets Oregon State's defensive strategy. This part of the field was just totally load the line of scrimmage. Dare Utah to throw the ball. And it worked. Rising throws back across. Three touchdowns. Oh, the return of the tight end to college football. He's on the left side, goes behind. The Effective down here using his legs. He's going to sling it out quickly to the right side. A quick hitter play. And that circular has really come almost full circle. Thomas in the backfield, gets the ball, huge block in the back. Every on Thomas' third touchdown of this first half. Oh, watch what this offensive line does to UCLA. They're oh. knocking everybody down. Oh, two, look at it. 
three drives of 75 yards. Yeah, one of them was littler. This one doesn't have to go 75 yards. And almost eight yards a carry. High snap. And after all that, Rising kept it, took a big... We've seen it all kinds of ways, but we, we keep seeing the constant theme of the two tight ends. The offense is ruling the day right now for Utah. It was a good decision. They went right down the field. They haven't been stopped yet. I'm, you know, people are going to go crazy with the initial ranking. Third down, Rising in the pocket. Throws that play. Rising takes a snap. Throws, and it's caught. What a nice catch. Then the big hit of the ball. Self. So Utah has the ball for the first time. Rising right over top the defender. Nice delivery. Tight end change from left to right. Rising, hands off, straight ahead with a nice hole. Nobody would get it. Uh, no, not many people who are younger than we are would get it, that's for sure. Rising, hands off, first down, and much more with blockers out in front. Man, Thomas. UCLA has not been able to create the edge, to, to hold the edge. Look, you got a tight end over there. Leverage right now, another blocker on the outside. They can't hold the edge. He doesn't need any water, Tavion Thomas. First down, Utes, play fake, rising, wants to go toward the end zone. Hop. Rising out of the shotgun, hands it off to Thomas. A penalty flag. Through. Bonds, John John Holding Bonds. Offense, number 77. That penalty is declined. Result to play, third down. For Thompson. You see 21 come up, you'll see the hold on your left. You see 21 coming up, watch him take on the tight end. Holds his ground, squeezes. There's no. He's going to get a few more snaps. He's a guy who doesn't play all the time for the Bruins. Rising on third and long. That to go was a good one. It gives you an, an insight into, and like a specific example is, you know, it, it'll be interesting to see how they play with that. The completion and the t from where they were prior to that snap. So it's second down and medium. Rising across the middle. Hits a tight end again. Those were great old days, right? I miss those days. Rising, almost like an option play, pinches it, and what a great catch on the pitch. Is that Rising was able to get rid of it. And I bet you that pass dropped by yesterday, got off the Peloton, then came to our production meeting to tell us about his team. Over the top and income. Is at peace with the kind of team he has right now. He knows that the defense isn't the typical defense that he has, but he's got to play defense. Uh, they have started to play better in this game. Utah first four times they had the ball tonight, scored a touchdown all four of those times. Since then, three positions. This on the edge and squeezing that outside play, that stretch play. Watch them squeeze this. They get to the tight end. They were not attacked. High snap. Good catch by Rising there. And under center on third and one. Handoff. Thomas made the cut, got the. I just, Allah he, City, he is so good over there. And I love what he says about playing football. I like to, I get to fight every single day. And I. I think he has played well tonight. You're right to point that out. First and 10, Utah. Rising deep and. Bad throw here or there, good coverage. It's limited them. Hand off and UCLA right not on him, really. <laughs> now that's an impact play from him. A little pressure. That leans back out to the throw that was away from him. You know, why you don't have someone run down the field and turn around? He really came to Utah from Katy, Texas as an undersized player. UCLA ran some sort of run blitz there, and that guy is going to take advantage of it every time because he's really, really good. Pledger straight ahead. Four downs, you should be running it here. They shift the tight ends. And they do hand it off. Straight ahead, big hole. First down and much more. And then climbing up to the linebackers made it so easy for Thomas. Look at this. Climb up. Here to Utah. They just rave about him. Play fake, wide open. That's Vele. Spin move inside. Another tribute to those two young men. The Utah Utes start the fourth quarter inside the 15. Rising. Next play, Utah's in the end zone. You know, we asked earlier, I mean, can this just be coincidence? 
It just seems put more thought into those rankings than Stormy Bonatoni. First down run for Utah. Said that, you know, if it's not good enough to be a year-round candy, it shouldn't be a candy in the first place. <laughs> Which was pretty funny from yeah. that the team was split 50-50 <laughs> over candy corn. <laughs> Focusing on the important stuff. Thomas straight ahead. Not like is the candy pumpkins, and people try to tell me they're the same. They're not the same. <laughs> <laughs> Penalty flag. So second and 17. Cam Rising in Utah. A little pump fake from Rising. And now going to scramble. And that was pretty good. Was the spy and was supposed to limit Rising. Now watch. He's in the middle of your screen. See number 10? He's just watching Rising. You go. I got you. There it is. Oops. Big third, third down. down. And seven. Big third down for UCLA's D. They need to stop. Four-man rush. Rising throws. And it is caught. Now, before the play, I thought there was a whistle, but no. And really take control of the Pac-12 South. Hand off. Top. Some new blood and the change. This may change over time, and it will. Alabama may wind up being number two, but for right now. For walk on Vele, first down Utes. And that hurts UCLA's chances big time. Yeah, it does. Overwhelming, and that's kind of been the case for most of this year. He's had some big statistical games, but it's much more than the numbers how he's transformed this team. Details of that waiver request was Cam Rising. So he sat out a year, waited his turn, won the job, immediately got hurt, didn't win the job this year. 136 yards, three touchdowns, six yards of carry tonight against what had been the best run defense in the Pac 12. UCLA. Bargain for UCLA. Thomas straight in and Tavion Thomas. That the number 22 was retired at the end of the first quarter.